Stewart is an amazing, amazing place where our girls get the opportunity to understand first what leadership means from within, how that connects to their spirituality, how it connects to their understanding of their intellectual identity, their social identity, and their emotional identity. STEM in itself is an integrated concept and our concept here of how our science, technology, engineering, and mathematics courses can really help our students understand how the content in the textbook actually relates to what they're seeing um, in their world and how they're making meaning of their world. Um, how is it all coming together? KMC Commander is an open, secure, and scalable solution. It actually is a very cost-effective way to get relevant data from any device to the cloud so that you can visualize it on your phone. Our relationship with Intel began in 2014, and we came together at the same time realizing that there was a convergence of IT and OT, and that really the solution was going to be a complete architecture for the Internet of Things. Getting data from many different sensors and devices to the cloud in a very cost-effective way. What we've been doing is advancing ideas of how new technologies can be used to make buildings more efficient and to extend the life of building assets. When we look at the intersection of operations and education, it was pretty clear to us as we explored multiple opportunities across various industries that there was needs within the educational space. Having the ability to provide them with tools and necessary operational capabilities that would allow them to drive operational efficiencies, better working conditions, better safety conditions, even better educational environments for students. The KMC Commander solution does an outstanding job of simplifying the process of learning these technologies and then in a real environment applying the solutions derived from those technologies that allows the students to actually experience the technology in a way that matters to them. Stuart is an architecturally significant building designed and built by a prominent architect from Princeton University in 1963. And while that beauty sort of is a, an overriding theme of, of our campus, it also provided significant challenges for providing an efficient and temperate environment in 2019. Commander and KMC Controls, along with our key vendors, NCON, have allowed us to significantly increase both the efficiency of the building and the average comfort of the building through control. So in the last four years, we've reduced our energy consumption at Stewart by about 43%, uh, which is obviously significant. Coming to a campus like this, I immediately was drawn by the fact that the building was, as I said, a sort of an integral component of the culture of the school. Students and faculty members, uh, alumni, are all very connected to the campus. I was fortunate enough to visit KMC in New Paris, Indiana about three years ago and saw a presentation of Commander and immediately thought that is an opportunity to dive deeper into our campus and the facilities and give students the opportunity to interact with the building at a different level. We've, along, again, along with KMC, Intel, and NCON, have developed a team that's put a very, very robust system in place that, again, gives us incredible control over our environment, but an incredible amount of data uh, to which we can see what's happening here. It really was made possible by not just the ability of that system to collect the data, but by the simple to use, graphically interesting interface of Commander. The real advantage for us from what we see on the technology side is the openness of it. Um, on the installation side, it's very easy to install. It's very quick to populate um, the information. And then with the cloud-based component of it, allowing people that are not necessarily the technical geniuses of the world, but having more students be able to get involved with it and the curiosity of the children 
We're well beyond anything we would think of in the normal engineering mechanical world that we would normally do every day. So a lot of the other products we've seen in the industry are, are, are cumbersome and expensive. The, the ease to market of this has allowed us to do things that normally we just couldn't. Um, with the technology that's here, here already, we were able to come in here in a very, very quick manner, get their cards built very, very quickly. Someone told me years ago when IoT was first becoming prevalent, the only limitation to this journey will be your imagination. And as a child says, hey, can we measure sound tier or temperature there or flow of the water there? The answer is now yes. I'm fortunate enough that I have a very talented group of AP Stats students who, even at this stage in the school year, eight months in, are nothing but curious. So I was just eager to bring them the most authentic data that I could find. So often we are contriving data we're performing experiments where our sample is the 11 kids sitting in the room, and it's not exactly a great study. But to pull real, measured, unbiased uh, information out of the building itself, it's as real of a study as could be. In fact, it is very much a study that would realistically be conducted by people in any other building that had a system like this. I mean, I'm very much looking forward to any more data that gets connected to this, especially on you know, real strong correlations uh, and just, you know, I can't turn down more data. I'm most excited for the students in some way to get access to the system. I showed them just the temperature in two rooms and they said, oh, but you know what, really we should check the temperature in C corridor because you're comparing two of the coldest rooms in the building, Mr. Malloy, we should be checking the preschool. Uh, let's bring that up. And, oh, here's the carbon dioxide. Well, what can we check the carbon dioxide levels from April 7th? We had that big conference that day. They immediately, once they understand the system, they want to dive into it as much as I do. They're curious, uh, they're excited to uh, dig deeper into that. They're gonna, as they always do, think of things I never would have thought of. They're going to come up with better lessons than I could have designed just from their own initiative. I've been thinking about Stewart's green energy use. So for a couple years now, I've had a dream kind of of Stewart using its large flat roof for solar panels. The area is a perfect candidate for that renewable energy. I'm thinking to pull things like daily usage of um, energy consumption, but then how it how it relates to like a school day, a weekend, summer, and then summer activities and things like that. It connects the numbers to life. Our ability to create excitement around lifelong learning here is greatly enhanced, I think, through the opportunities we have with Commander and the data that it gives us about our campus. 